Hey YouTube, hey Facebook, hey everybody. Um, such an honor to be here before you guys on tonight. I am very thrilled, I'm very excited. Um, I am so thankful for each and every one of you guys. As once again, this is uh, Trevay Willis, your motivational speaker, your life coach. And um, I'm just excited to be here on tonight. Um, I have did a lot of, made up a lot of accomplishments lately. Um, my book is finally completed. It's ready to go to publishing. And um, I have, you know, a lot of uh, hopes for this book. I know that it's going to be very successful. I know it's guys, guys, it's going to be a instrument to helping you all. I know there's still going to be some times you're going to need me. Um, but when I'm not available, say in the daytime and, you know, this book is really going to help you guys to get to your next level. It's going to lay out everything you need to know. And um, it's going to talk to you about insurance, pricing, contracts, all that for saying forth. Um, so you guys be on the lookout for that coming out soon. It should be out in another week or two. And but I will get up here and let you all know when it has hit. And so you guys can go to Amazon, order your book and have it there so that if you're also interested in being in the industry or you're already in the industry, these are some pointers that can help you guys to be successful and to be even more successful. Now, once again, I'm always tell you this because I'm a humble type person. Um, these are my opinions. These are um, things that I, you, I utilize to help me to become successful. Um, so you can use, take some nuggets, take what you can out of it, apply it to your company and just be the greatest you can be. Um, with that being said, guys, I woke up this morning and uh, there was something that was led to my heart to speak to you guys briefly about. Um, I've been helping a lot of people get started lately. And basically, I'm only one guy, so I can't help everybody. But, hey, I do the very best I can to be there for as many people as I possibly can. And I tell them my expectations, like, look, I'm only one guy. I do the very best I can do. Um, but with that being said, guys, um, I've got one specific um, mentoree that I am helping. And they you know, basically got all the information by me and I give them information, you know, to help them to become a successful uh, owner with their transportation company. However, I noticed one thing. There was a, some brokers that I gave in the list to this individual and to a lot of you guys. Um, and they specifically applied to become a provider for these brokers. However, the broker sent back you know, the paperwork, they fill the paperwork out and then they got a response back stating your rates are too high. Drop your rates. OK, the question I was asking him is, it is he talking about rates for as laboratory or rates for as wheelchair? And they're basically stating wheelchair. OK, let's pause here. What is considered high in this industry for this broker or this particular broker. Well, Trey, what was the, uh, the the non emergency medical transport new owner quoting them? Basically, they were quoting this company, specific company, off the rates that I gave them that I charged for my company. Okay, there's a problem here. Let's just back up. This specific prov um, transportation broker is telling this individual. That $29 one way within 10 miles is what they're going to pay them, okay? And if you look at it, 29 going, 29 back, that's not a lot of money, okay? Let me tell you the reason why that's not a lot of money, okay? It's not a lot of money because of the fact if you have a driver, you're going to have to pay your driver $12, $13 an hour. Then you got your fuel, and then you got all these other expenses, and then you got to also pay yourself. So $29 going, $29 coming back. That's not a lot of money. And then a lot of times these trips that these brokers are giving you are will call base. Now, another thing I'm going to throw at you guys. The reason why I know that the uh, response that he got was bogus. And the fact of the matter is they was only charge, try, trying to charge him 29 one way and 29 back was garbage. The reason why it's garbage is because of the fact I deal with that same broker and we're charging them 125 to 150 per trip. Yet this new guy that's coming in is proposing the same rap, rap, uh, rates that I am giving him. Actually, he's a little bit cheaper, $10 cheaper, and they're stating his rates are too high, but yet they still pay me the rates, those type of rates, $125, $150. So that's how I know they're full of crap. Guys, I'm going to be real with you. When you guys are starting out, now this is not discouraging. This is just something 
for you to be wise and keen, okay? A lot of times you have to watch out for some of these people. You have to watch out for some of these people that call you shopping around because really they've already did their homework. They've already called other companies and they're trying to get the cheapest way out. Now with a specific broker, they know better than that. They know better than that because they're paying all these other companies $150 to $200 per wheelchair trip when you're the new kid on the block and they're trying to charge or will try to give you rates of $29 one way, $29 back. That's lowballing. That's lowballing. And I would not accept that, guys. Guys, I know that you guys are eager to get out there and get business, but please, at the end of the day, do not allow these companies to walk over you because what they're trying to do is they see that maybe there's something that you said in your statement, your verbiage, indicating that you are new in the business. So they're going to be trying to get over on you and trying to get the cheapest rates, lowest rates possible. For instance, Motive Care, Logistic Care, um, Southeast Trans, all those companies. They're going to low by, they, they have came to my office several times and look, sit down with me trying to get me to do a contract. Well, neither did they know sitting down with me they found out quickly that I was not an amateur with this. They know they cannot get over on me. I'm going to get what I want and I'm going to get the rates that I want to get these jobs done. Because at the end of the day, yes, it's all about the client. But yes, it's all about paying these bills too because you got to pay fuel, driver, insurance, all that type of stuff. How you get your formula to pay your bills every day. Divide your insurance, what it costs for the whole entire month by 20. Now, if you do more than 20 days, that's great. But basically, like my company, we only work 20 days a month. Five days a week, we don't work weekends or anything like that. So we take the insurance uh, premium. Okay, maybe our insurance premium is $3,900 a month. All right, 39 divided by 20. So that if 39 divided by 20, that gives you what you're supposed to pay to your insurance per day. Uh, fuel is kind of, you know, if you don't understand what the charge for fuel. But you get the concept. These are expenses that you have. These expenses are too expensive for you to be lowballing yourself. And, and another thing too, you gotta realize, if you stoop down to their level and charge these low rates to get the job, you have just degraded yourself and, less, and devalue your business because of the fact of the matter is, you're doing a service, you're, you're, you're out there caring for people, but yet these people out here that's giving you these low rates don't even own one single van. But yet you're owning the van and you're owning all what comes behind the van. So when it comes down to dealing with these people and you're new in the industry, be very keen, wise, and be careful. Okay? If you have any questions about what to charge, just email me. Because I would rather for you to email me versus for you to get out there and you're getting taken advantage over and you're getting used. There's a lot of companies out there that has actually are, are being used because of the fact of the matter is the brokers don't want to pay because the brokers are trying to keep more money in their pockets. That's how they do things. So I want you to be careful, be wise, think, ask questions, learn, you know, you, because in reality, this is your dream. This is your calling. So you deserve to go out there and, you know, Enjoy what you do. Help the people. Be, um, you know, a hero to these people because these are, sometimes you're the only ones that they know. And make the kind of money that you need to make to pay your bills and put in your pocket at the same time. That's what I'm saying. So I want you guys to be wise and careful when it comes to this because I've been in this game since 2015. And I, it, well, 2015 for my company, but I was a manager, an ops manager for another company dealing the same thing. And I know how this stuff works. I don't want you guys to get taken advantage over, you know, because everybody's, a lot of times people are always out there to get the cheapest thing possible. And a lot of times cheap ain't good. Okay. I have not lowered my rates because of the fact we know what we do for these people. We know we service these people very well. We get these people out of bed. We have ramps to go outside your steps. These are some of the qualities and some of the, the extra premium services that we offer. So just putting it to you out there like that, guys. Um, think about it. And guys, like I said, stay tuned to the book that's coming out. It's going to help you guys. It's full of wisdom, knowledge, 
And the same way I talk to you guys on the video is the same way I talk to you in the book. It's, you know, basically it's a spinoff of the, um, the video, but it's just a little bit more entailed because, you know, this is something that you can keep to reference when it comes out of your company. Take the nuggets, take the gems, run with it, fl uh, fly high, guys. I care about you guys. And even though I don't know you, I don't have to know you to care about you. Because at the end of the day, everybody deserves to be successful. Everybody deserves a chance at life. You know, um, you know, there's no sense of you being down, you know, and having less than what you deserve. Everybody deserves something well in their life and perfect in their life. So if, if this medical transportation business is your calling, if this is what you want to do, just listen to different people that's in the industry. You don't have to necessarily just listen to me by yourself. Listen to other people that's in the industry on YouTube. Learn from them. Learn from me. Take what you can and apply it to yourself. Apply it to your business. And have a successful business. Create a legacy for your kids. And um, enjoy your life. You know, you deserve it, guys. I, I've had a bad life coming up in the earlier ages. Um, younger, teenage years is bad. And I've always dreamed of being an entrepreneur. I always dreamed. But I didn't know my calling. So, I, you know, I had to ask God. I said, God, what is my calling? What's my purpose in life? And this is what he showed me was the fact that I was good with elderly people and transportation. So here I am. This is the reason why I'm successful. Not only am have I become successful with um, the medical transportation, but I'm a mouthpiece and I'm a servant for you all. This is the reason why I do these videos. This is the reason why I wrote the book. Because there are people out there starving and hungry. And there's other people that has already been there, but won't share the information. And that's wrong. That's not right. I think it's BS. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm an Aries, so I'm straightforward. But it's not right that we withhold information from people. That's why I tell you the ins and outs. And, I, you know, every problem in life has a solution. So I want you guys to thrive. I want you guys to do well. And, guys, I'll be here the best I possibly can for you. Like I said, I'm one man. You may text me. You may call me. I may not be able to pick up right then and there. I may have a lot of people calling me, but guys, I'm doing the best I can do. So I'm here for you. I'm going to continue to do these videos until I get 80 years old and, um, you know, use what you can. If you, you, There's a lot of things you may not agree with on me, but it's all based off opinion and experiences. So I'm not up here saying I'm the, the, G, the, the guru or the Wikipedia or anything like that. I'm going off my knowledge. I'm going off of experiences. And I'm going off the best possible um, choices that we can make during this industry. So, guys, I love you. And I hope you have a wonderful day and uh, a wonderful night. I'm going to bed now. And uh, thank you for all of you guys that support me. Thank you for, I'm um, not going to really say a fan base, but thank you for my fan base. Um, thank you for everything. I, I appreciate you guys. I'm humble. Um, you know, one last thing I'm going to say. Um, even though you guys think a lot of me, you, you say such nice, kind things about me, I would never allow subscribers or the, the nice comments cause me to have a big head and cause me to feel like I am invincible to people or not make myself available. I am humble. I don't care. I'm going to be always here for people the best I can. So I just want to leave it out there because somebody said, oh, you're getting a lot of attention. You get a lot of fame now. No, I'm not. I'm, just, I'm an average person. I'm from North Carolina. I'm country. I eat barbecue. And um, I just I just love people. I got this, this gift from my mother, you know. Um, and then my kids are developing this gift, this outspoken gift. It's a gift, a quality from God. I'm going to use it. Um, even though if you don't believe in God or whatever the case may be, I do. But I'm going to use what I believe to help you, no matter what you believe in. I don't care if you're Muslim, you know, atheist, whatever. I'm going to use my gift to apply it to help you guys. Guys, I'm going to sleep. I love you guys. Take care. Take what I can. Take what you can from me or everybody else. Apply it and go be great. I'm out, guys.